Hi, I'm Andrea Bevan, one of the legate agents based here in Saint-Gervais-le-Bain in the haute savoie region of the French Alps. Over the next couple of days, Saint-Gervais is lucky enough to be hosting the only French stage of this year's Telemark World Cup. And as proud sponsors of the British team, we're here to cheer on our races. Today, we're going to be introducing you to the town of Saint-Gervais-le-Bain itself, talking about the property market, both here and more broadly across the Alps, and of course, checking out the action from some of the racing. Saint-Gervais-le-Bain is more than just a ski resort. With a long history of tourism dating back to the 19th century with the opening of the famous thermal baths, this is a town with a lot to offer. People head here from all over the world to enjoy everything that the mountains and the town provides. And with the peak of Mont Blanc sitting in the commune of Saint-Gervais-le-Bain itself, the views really are out of this world. In the winter, the Avasia Mont Blanc ski area has 445 kilometers of piste, making it the third largest ski domain in France. France has seen a real boom in the property market over the last couple of years, and we've seen a strong increase in second home sales, both to French and international clients, right across France, but particularly here in the Alps. I'm here with my colleague, Andrew Morgan, to understand a little bit more about the property market locally. Andrew, what kind of properties are our clients buying here currently? Saint-Gervais, we have everything from what we will call starter apartments, studio apartments, just a little ski pad, through to two bed, three bed apartments, which are very popular. Townhouses, where people can easily walk to the bars and restaurants, make full use of the facilities. We have a lot of chalets for sale, farmhouse renovations, land. New build property has been very popular these last 12 months. Uh, be it apartments or be it chalets themselves. What kind of budgets would our clients need to buy here in Saint-Gervais? From 100,000 for a studio apartment, uh, typical one bed, one bed with a bunk area would be maybe 250, and then for a three bed, four bed apartment, we're looking at four to 500,000. Chalets, anything from about 850 up to over a million, of course. We have some big farmhouse renovations, close to the two million. However, that gives you six ensuite bedrooms, two bedroom apartment, and stunning location. Finance is still possible for British clients. We have a range of mortgage options through our partners uh, with some surprisingly low interest rates that can be very attractive to British buyers. What's the appeal of Saint-Gervais and why do you think it's becoming so popular? For a lot of people, it's the position. We are under an hour's drive from Geneva. There is a new fast train service from Geneva direct to Saint-Gervais station. Uh, our location close to Megev, just behind me, and Chamonix, just to my right. Uh, both of which are within half an hour's drive. What drew me here, it's a real French village. We have a spa town, we have a great summer, and the bars, restaurants, the shops are open all year round. Why do our clients choose to work with Leggett when they want to buy or sell property here? One of the main reasons is our presence locally. We live in the villages we work in. We have lived there a long time in many cases. We have good local knowledge, but we also demystify the process help you throughout the process and again living here we really can give you the local knowledge that we're known for. So the property market's really hot here at the moment, what's it looking like across the rest of the Alps? There's a high demand across the whole of the Alps whether we're talking about specifically within ski resorts, some of the more rural areas or down by the lakes near Lake Annecy, uh, Exleban, very popular destinations. Uh, I think with everything that's happened over the last two years we know that people are looking for a bit more space, they're working from home more so priorities have changed and that's really driven the property market across the whole of the Alps, whether we're talking about three valleys, whether it's in La Plaine, Les Arcs, up in Val d'Isère, or more and more popular in the Southern Alps, Ser Chevalier around the Briançon area. We have more and more demand and it's becoming a very popular area as we open it up to international trade. Telemark skiing uses a specialised type of bindings which fix only the toe of the ski boot to the ski, thereby creating a free heel. Telemark is a skiing technique that combines elements of both alpine and Nordic skiing and is named after the region in Norway where the discipline originated. A Telemark competition includes many different elements including giant slalom, a jump, a loom which is a 360 degree bank turn, and a skating part. 
All of these elements are linked together, which is going to make for exciting viewing here today on the Petite Paul piste on the slopes of San Nicolas de Vros, just above saint gervais le -Bain. Let's see some of the races in action. How did it go today, Jasmine? Not, uh, not an ideal start. Um, I crashed on my first run, but I think that you know came into play a bit on my second run as well. So yeah, just hoping to have a better day tomorrow, really. And how was the course today? Yeah, really good, really good. Uh, the jump's really fun. Uh, the steep wall is is awesome, um, and a great skate as well. Yeah, race was good. Snow held up the the both runs, which was a. Uh... It's a big plus compared to most stations where the snow deteriorates after both uh, after the second run. Um, yeah, the good skate, enjoyed it. A uh, bit slower in the giant section. Jump was all right, I landed one, not the other, but looking forward to tomorrow anyway. The course was all right today, nice jump, uh, nice and tight after the jump. Uh, so it'll be longer tomorrow, almost double the length. So the race tomorrow is a classic, so it's going to be longer. Um, and the skate will also be uh, probably a bit longer as well. Um, so the classic start is probably twice as far up the piste. Um, so it should be a good race. Yeah. Okay, well done for today. Good luck Thank tomorrow. You very much. Thank, Thank you. We have been supporting the British team as a partner for the last three years now, I think, possibly into the fourth season. It was a connection through one of the competitors who knew one of our agents and we said, well, no, we won't sponsor the competitor, we'll sponsor the team. And we've been supporting them at the events ever since. We've just completed the second day prize giving of the World Cup Telemark here in Saint Gervais. The British team fared well with our sponsorship. Jasmine Taylor taking a sixth place and a fifth place over the two days. We, like them, hope that this will become a Winter Olympic sport in due course and we'll be holding another stage next year up in Le Contamine. We hope you've enjoyed watching and if you've got any questions at all about Saint Gervais or the region or buying a property here, please do get in touch and we'll be delighted to help. Thanks very much. Thank you. Hope to see you soon.